Assalomu alaykum qadrli talabalar. Bugun sizlar bilan birgalikda Mirzoobek nomidagi O'zbekiston Milliy universiteti xorijiy filologiya fakulteti ingliz filologiyasi kafedrasi o'quvchisi Ismoil Onurxon Tiximjonovni. Bugun sizlar bilan birgalikda ikkinchi bosqich talabalari uchun maxsus asosiy o'rganilayotgan chet tili, matbuot tili modulidan abbreviations in newspaper articles gazeta maqolalaridagi abbreviaturalar to'g'risida video dars olib boramiz. Video darsimiz ingliz tilida bo'lganligi uchun keling uni ingliz tilida davom ettirsak. So let's start our video lesson in English language. Uh, I'm a teacher at the National University of Uzbekistan. Uh, hi dears, this is a 16th practical lesson abbreviations in newspaper articles. According to our curriculum, I am Ismail Nurkhan Khamjanovna. My email address is nurkhanismailva.94 at gmail.com. So, let's begin. <clears throat> we can see a lot of abbreviations in newspaper articles. Now we will discuss type of abbreviations and how they can be shortened. As you know, abbreviations, this is a shortened form of words in order to make the important words in proper nouns are capitalized. Um, the most uh, in, important fact is abbreviations can, or words can be shortened or abbreviated only proper nouns, measurements, uh, name of um, name of months, and name of streets, and also um, then um, time measures. For example. The abbreviations and initials that are sometimes used in a place of proper nouns are also capitalized. Read the names. Notice the use of periods. Mary Smith Baldwin, M.S. Baldwin, Mary Smith, John Rob Duffy, J. R. Duffy. Some common nouns become proper nouns when used with names. These words include Mr., Doctor, Reverend, Junior, and Senior. When used with names, they are capitalized and abbreviated. For example, Mr. James L. Taylor, Jr. Miss Catherine Williams. Miss Catherine Williams. Then Dr. Mary St. Hoyt, for example. Mrs. Angela Barrera. When used with proper noun names, they are capitalized and abbreviated. Next one. Professional and academic degrees are abbreviated in newspapers and used after person's name. Note the use of commas and periods. Doctor of Medicine, Janet Buckley, MD. Doctor of Philosophy, uh, for example, Jeremy Flintus, Doctor of Philosophy, PhD. Janet Barclay, Doctor of Medicine, MD. Some abbreviations are used in charts and lists, but not in sentences. For example, as I uh, have seen before the headlines, they are given always sun, for example, sun, 12th October. Sun and days of um, week. They are also are abbreviated. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and so on. And um, and also um, mothers can be abbreviated. Note use of commas and periods with days and datas. Thursday, January January three. Thurs dot comma Jen. This abbreviated dot three. Proper names of streets are often abbreviated in addresses. For example, street, st, avenue, ave dot, court, ct dot, road, rd dot, like this. The post office prefers 
that you use its abbreviations of state names when you write addresses. Note the use of commas. Periods are not used. For example, Houston Tass or Houston Checks, it will be like this. Full list of state abbreviations on page uh, 179 uh, in our module are given. Next, class exercise. In our video class exercise, we have to just shorten each address correctly that are given below. Tell where you would use capital letters and punctuation marks. Use initials for first and middle names. Use the post office abbreviation for each state. And as a home task, There is given a task, who's, who, abbreviations for people titles. And here is given a little information about abbreviation. What is it and when can we use it? We discussed it in our video lesson. And you have to rewrite each sentence with the correct abbreviations. For example, prison caught a mat with secretary events to discuss matter. You will do all the tasks, then you will upload to the National University Moodle. You will do all the tasks as a home task and classwork, and you will upload to the Moodle of National University of Uzbekistan. In our video, video lesson, we use it education.com and .com's resources. And finally, I am here to help. Please, don't hesitate if you have any questions. My email address is given here, nurhan.ismailva.94 at gmail.com. Thank you for your kind attention. Это Баринюсчун Рахмат.